Welcome to Peanuts Automotive Adventures. Yeah, that's Peanut. I'm James. Welcome to Peanuts Automotive Adventures, where every day is an automotive adventure around here, right? Yeah. So today's video is on. Before we get into that, let's give an official shout out to our, our official sponsors, yeah. the graphicspotsva.com. There you go. It's going to be right there. You know, reach out to them for anything, banners, decals. Y'all know the drill team run it. Uh, graphic design. Uh, custom graphics, uh, yard signs, um, vehicle signs, you drag racers that need y'all number sets, reach out to them, you know what I'm saying? Um, and your name yeah. uh, on your on your uh, hot rod, you know, reach out to them. They can get it all done. Mm -hmm. They can get you squared away. And our uh, next sponsor is Innovative, Innovative Powders. Powders. Anything that needs powder coating, reach out to them. Um, where's it going to be, Peanut? Where's it going to be? You swinging on the, there you go. It's going to be right there. And, uh, you know, reach out to them. They can powder coat anything for you, big or small. Reach out to them, any color, uh, custom colors, uh, innovative powders can do it all. So reach out to them. Um, you know, we enjoy their work. You know, we appreciate their hard work when it comes to things that we get done by them. Today's video, short video, short and sweet. We're going to show y'all some of the upgrades we did actually last night. Not late last night, but last night around eight o'clock, uh, we uh, we went ahead and installed the rest of the upgrades that came in for the Mustang, right? Project yeah. Blueberry, our new Edge Mustang. We're setting it up for autocross, which is tomorrow morning. We're gonna be autocrossing it tomorrow morning. So um, we're just gonna go over a couple of little things that we did and some more future things that we're gonna do to it. So let me turn this camera around. All right, team running. Let's show you what me and Peanut installed yesterday. We're going to start off with the, if y'all can see it, the solid, uh, let me back up. Peanut's pointing at it, the solid transmission mount right there. On the instructions, it said this adjustable side should be, be on the driver's side, which is right here, but it wouldn't line up. Yeah, you So were. I had to put it on this side. You're right. You're right. We had to flip it, y'all. So Show them the instructions. Go grab, grab them. them instructions. Yeah, the instructions for the mount, like Peanut was stating. These adjustable bolts supposed to be been on, see them right there on the side? Was supposed to be been on the driver's side, but the bolts didn't line up to the transmission. I mean, to the mounts right here on the frame. So we flipped it around. I took it back down, flipped it around. Everything lined up perfectly. So, you know, Peanut's right. He got the instructions right there. You know, we do read the instructions around here some days. It and says, where's it driver at? Driver side. That's the adjustable side. That's the not adjustable side. You're right. <laughs> yep, you're right. So, pro thing, reach out to me if I can help y'all. <laughs> no, nah, I'm just kidding. But, you know, it is what it is. They, um, yeah, it's up. It's in there. Yeah. It's solid. We did a road test last night. And, and, and we just put, um, zip zip tied the yeah the o2 sensor wiring we had a zip tie before yeah. it wouldn't touch the exhaust the hot exhaust yeah last but not least go ahead the a stock cross member um brace from maximum motorsports we went ahead and installed that easy install easy yeah. install um we have replaced it with this bar here go ahead show them that bar yeah we had the the two point bar on there we went with the four point bar for maximum motorsports very easy install you got to release that bar you know um what is it called peanut you got to uninstall that bar and put that four point up in there you know it's just uh whatever we're trying to do we're trying to you know make the car you know stiff and handle better but we'll see tomorrow once we get out there on course see how she handles but everything bolted up just fine listen now maximum motorsports instructions was on point 
everything bolted up just fine. So, you know, we're going to figure it out, y'all. We either want to have a lot of understeer or a lot of oversteer. Because yeah. I know the car ain't neutral. So, we're going to figure it out. Hopefully, I'd rather have oversteer than understeer. I hate pushing. I don't like understeer. That's, that's one of the reasons why I really don't like autocross and front-wheel drive cars. Because of the um, understeer in them. But I know from the factory, from what I've been reading up on, the new edges came from the factory with a lot of understeer, you know, for the consumer market. So I, I hope we got a ton of oversteer peanut. And like I said in another video, a couple of videos ago, this is still the factory rear sway bar. I don't want to keep throwing parts at it. Well, we have been, but I want to keep this factory sway bar because it might not even need a bigger rear sway bar. You know, so, and also I'm going to keep that factory V8 sway bar just in case the uh, QA1 sway bar, you know, is too much. So we got options. We got options. So that's pretty much it, y'all. We're going to go ahead in this short video. We're going to have a video uh, when we at the event tomorrow. We also pretty much it's like a test and tune event, but, but we're competing. Say again. Yeah, we changed the transmission fluid. Uh yeah, uh, you know, yeah, we, we, it needed to be changed. So went on here, did that last night too. Um, what else? What else? That's pretty much it. Let me turn this uh, camera around. Talk to y'all a little bit more before we sign off. All right, team runner, the class I'm going to be running in is a uh, classic American muscle, uh, traditional cam T. Uh, we're going to go ahead and run in that class. It's about three or four of us in that class right now, but I don't, I don't plan on placing or anything because I'm still learning the car, still trying to figure it out. But we're going to go out there and give it a good. Oh, my bad. My bad. My bad. He's back here jumping up and down. My bad. Let me lean down. Come on up. Come on up. My bad. Um, I just want to learn the car, go out there, you know, and give it a good um, give it a good push. You know, try to push it to its limits. Yeah. See where it's at. Uh, take me a notebook. Don't forget I need a notebook if I can write everything down because I can't remember um, I suffer from CRS. One day you're going to know what that means. <laughs> so, and, um, you know, we're going to go out there, write stuff down, get, we're going to get, we're going to have the car dialed in little by little, add a little bit of parts here and there. We still got to change out the shocks and struts, but these are fine for now. Uh, right now this is more of a budget build, I think. So, you know, we are going to go ahead and give it a good heave hole. We're going to get it off this lift and get it outside and wash it on up. But Hey, don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, and share. Hit that notification. And hit that notification bell, y'all. You know what I'm saying? When we have another videos coming out and whatnot. Uh, what else we got going on? The autocross. Mm -hmm. We're going to be going to Outer Banks next yeah. weekend. Man, I can't wait. We can't wait to go to the Outer Banks, to the uh, to the Rod Run down there. It ain't called Rod Run. It's called something else. But uh, we'll figure it out. Uh, we're going to be bringing y'all that footage, too. Uh, what else we going to be doing? We got to get... Peanuts Junior Dragster out there in them beams. Maybe on May 12th. They got a testing tune night. Yeah. Uh, we we gonna get you in them beams, load you up, get you in them beams, let you let, let, let you get a feel for the Junior Dragster. But you know, it's gonna happen. It's gonna happen. But hey, y'all, that's Peanut. I'm James. This is Peanuts Automotive Adventure, where every day's automotive adventure. We out. Peace. Peace.